Johnny Rochette with the home crowd going nuts here in Canada. Taking the ice. This is Sisney, your leader. We saw it, Paul, with Matt Savoy earlier, talked about him going to school full-time, getting a master's degree. Johnny Rochette talking about how important that is. Does it help keep perspective? Absolutely, and I love the, the comment that she made about meeting other people. When a day went bad at the rink, I would go to school and just sort of delve into that. Yeah. Rochette in third after the short program, but almost eight points off the lead of Sisney. She took the ice. She is a powerful jumper. She starts here with a three jump combination, triple toe loop, double toe loop, double loop. technique on her triple lutz as she draws back. No flutz there. Double toe loop, holding on to it a little bit. Just has wonderful run out on all of her landings, which, which really holds a wide, long riding edge. Very hard to do. Here's a second triple lutz. It's after the first half of the program, so it's a bonus. Beautiful. And this program, less breathless than last year's long program, although that was very successful for her in the Grand Prix. I think she wound up getting tired at Worlds. Mm -hmm. This has a, a very nice pace to it. It was a terrific Grand Prix for her last year. She won the medal at the final, the bronze. First one for a Canadian woman since 1996. But as you mentioned, very disappointing at Worlds where she came in 11th. Triple flip difficult at the end of the program because it takes such right arm strength and it's popped into a single. But the exception to the rule in this program. the tail end of the program, she accelerates into a double axle sequence into triple sow cow. Very difficult, wonderful. I love a skater who leaves something at the end. The punch. Plenty of punch at the end. The entire contingent going nuts along with everybody in this arena. Joni Rochette never ran out of steam. She got better and better. And it started right here with a three jump combination. Triple toe loop, nice height, beautiful air position. Then watch the double toe and the double loop. Nice height, beautiful run out. 
But the single flip, her hips and shoulders just get around just a little bit too far. But at the end of the program, the double axle sequence into the triple sow cow. Never losing a beat, getting the job done, and the strength, it was all there. Relief, exultation, all in one. So Joni Rochette needing 117.65. That's a lot to overcome there. There are the numbers not going to get there. 107.62. But a great way to start the year, nonetheless. 158.30. Currently in second place, Alyssa Sisney is still your leader.